Hi guys, today I'm going to talk to you about finding uh, outsourcers and outsourcing your business or your agency, whatever you might have. Now I think that uh, hiring and outsourcing is very intimidating to a lot of people and it's, it's, uh, it seems to be a lot harder in most people's minds than it really actually is. Um, now I'm going to just be full disclosure here, I don't really have a ton of experience with outsourcers but I do have a few weeks experience and I've gone through the process of hiring um, some for multiple jobs at this point and uh, they're working out fine right now. Not a whole lot of success, but it's we're still in the initial phases of setup, so it's, you know, as with any agency, you don't you know, necessarily expect results until, uh, you know, two or three weeks, three, even four maybe, but uh, that's just the nature of the game. So, but um, to find outsources is actually really simple. I'd probably just go to Upwork.com because they've already filtered everybody out for you. It's very easy to find exactly what you're looking for. There's loads of people that want to do the job, the exact job for the exact pay you have. Um, and people really aren't that expensive. If you find um, like people from other countries, there's like, for example, I have an outsourcer doing a, uh, a client AdWords for, and this guy is 100% success, you know, over 100,000 generated on Upwork. He's worked over 6,000 hours or something crazy like that. And, uh, I mean, he's managing the account for, like, double digits a week, you know, like, nothing. It's, uh, it's pretty great. And, and it's, and it's due to, I mean, he's a professional, you know, I think he works for, like, $35 an hour, but the thing is, like, the really professional guys, um, it just doesn't take them very much time to accomplish things. So, they can manage, even charging that, you know, high hourly rate, they just get things done so fast and effectively that they... They don't, because I, what you do, and, oh, and, and you don't want to charge hourly. Hourly is the worst for both parties. Um, you want to charge fixed rates. So how you do this, if they want to work hourly, you just go, hey, how many hours is it going to take you to do this job? And they'll say, oh, it takes me, you know, X hours. And you'll be like, okay, I'll just bill you a fixed rate for that amount of hours. And they're going to be like, okay, that's fine. And then that way, both of you win. He has to get the job as fast, as done as fast as he can, and you are not going to go over your fixed amount. Um, the cool thing about Upwork as well is that they hold all of your money in escrow. So uh, when you start a project, you can fund the project. That way your outsourcer knows that the money's there. He's not going to get screwed. Um, and then you, you, you don't have to pay them until the uh, work is done. So that's an extra layer of security um, that comes with uh, using Upwork. And so that's why I recommend it. That's pretty much all I've used so far, and it's it's working out pretty great. But yeah, just go hire experts. Um, and the, the other thing is you don't really need to train them if they're experts because, like with me, I don't really know I can do AdWords, you know, enough to be dangerous, but definitely not an expert, so it's not like I can teach them much except just show them what to do. And then they pretty much just go at it. I mean, the guy built all the campaigns for me. He even made display campaigns and uh, found all the keywords. Now, of course, it still needs tweaking and tuning. You have to manage it, of course, but... Most of the legwork is done. It would have taken me you know, dozens and hundreds of hours to figure out all the things that he can accomplish in just a couple. So definitely worth it. Um, try to go out and outsource as absolutely soon as possible. You'll save yourself so much time, effort, and energy, and uh, stress, more importantly. And you'll be able to get more sales and get more clients and make more money. So that's my recommendation for the day. All right, thanks, guys. Have a good day.